Hello everybody, it's Jay here on Travis' channel, and this week we are talking about names. Now, as I already said, my name's Jay, and I don't know where my name came from. I was originally going by Jared. I decided that was a stupid name. My mum wanted me to go by Jensen. I also decided that was a stupid name. And I just went with Jay, and I don't know where it came from. I don't know why I'm Jay, really. My full name's Jason. And I don't know where that one came from either, really. I have a teddy bear called Jason that I've had since I was about seven, but I don't think that was it, strangely enough. Um, my name is just... I have a full name, Jason, and the name everyone calls me Jay, because that's where my birth name was. I had a full name that nobody ever called me, and a name that everyone called me that was a shortened version of my full name. So that's where that idea came from. But really, I don't know where my name came from. So have I changed my name at state? No. Because in Ireland you have to change your name by deep poll. And then once you've changed by deep poll to change it on everything else, you have to present this deed poll and be like, yep, change my name. But basically it's more hassle to do it if you're under 16 than it is to do it if you're over 16. And because I'm only going to be turning 15 in a few weeks, we're going to leave it for a while. Because it's just going to be easier for us to do it once I'm over 16. And because it's just hassle. Now, I don't know if that's how it's done in every country. But, like, still, we're just leaving it for a while. So, how's my name been received? My mum, as I said, wanted me to be Jensen. I would have been called Kieran had I been born a boy. So my middle name is Kieran. Um, I recently came out in school, so my name has only recently become known to the other 150 people in my year, and my teachers. So it was interesting to see how they took my name. A lot of people just went with it, because J is the same letter as my birth name. So people just went with it. Because for a while, some people that I have been out to have been calling me Jay, and everyone just assumed it was a nickname. So, basically, nobody has any issues with my name, because it's just so similar to what my birth name was already. I made it as easy as possible, effectively. Um, most people are using it as often as they can, and I haven't come across anyone refusing to use my name at all. So, why did I feel the need to change my name? The name I had before I changed my name, my birth name, was a very feminine name and for me that made me really uncomfortable it got to a point where even like when i was still being called this name every day in school i was having this massive disconnect with the name and i didn't want to have to deal with that name because that name just felt like it was tying me down and holding me back and it was making me sad and i couldn't deal with having that name for the rest of my life so I changed. And that's all I have really to say about names. But if you're ever trying to figure out what you want to rename yourself, just nobody can tell you what to call yourself. So you really just have to look up baby names and eventually find one. <laughs> So that's it this week, um, there's subscribes and likes and descriptions and all that kind of thing, uh, videos every day mostly, um, and new topics every week, so be sure to come back and you might see me again here next week. J out. This week on Trans Your Channel we are talking about trans fashion. So I'm in front of my wardrobe and I'm going to give you all some of my fashion tips, also just, they're really just passing tips, what I wear to be comfortable in myself and to be comfortable passing or feeling confident that I could pass.